live. Do it live. This is Jacob Nelson, and you are listening to the KLG thing. Crazy Awesome Radio Show. It should post to. Okay, uh, let's actually be serious now. God, just <clears throat> stop it. This is eight Jacob minutes Nelson, ago. My lovely KLG ex. Crazy liked awesome the radio show. This is Jacob Nelson, and you are, are listening to KLG Crazy Awesome Radio All Show. Right. This is Jacob Nelson, and you are listening to <laughs> KLG Crazy Awesome Radio Show. This is Jacob Nelson, and you are listening to KLG Crazy Awesome Radio Show. We we are we are live. Wait, why is my thing taking so long? Um, <laughs> this is this is KLG Crazy Awesome Radio. <laughs> <laughs> is it is it messing up? Is it are we still having those technical difficulties? We've been having technical difficulties. <laughs> 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 like all like <laughs> you don't know how how much like no. <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah, it's uh all I can say is uh down with Skype. <laughs> yeah, down with Skype. I don't know, Skype Skype was acting silly. And it, yeah. it was mistreating us all this time. And we just, yeah. we would have had an earlier start. <laughs> and we wanted to have an earlier start. And it just, I don't know. It just didn't happen the way we wanted it to. But so is life. <laughs> That's good. It, yeah, it, it's good that we're finally That was good. That was good. We're even, on. We're live. Yeah, even, it's like five hours late. But, it's, you know, it, we're live. What we, you know, sometimes we say we're going to do it and we don't do it. <laughs> Yeah. So you can't say we didn't do it this time. Yeah, I know. Like people are like, oh, they're they're switching it up. Oh, they're really doing it. Oh god. They're, they're doing it now. Okay. <laughs> all right. <laughs> so for all you people out there that do not know, this is KLG Crazy Awesome Radio. I'm Cloudy Girl, your friendly Cloudy hey. Girl, friendly neighborhood Cloudy Girl, and <laughs> and I'm Panda Star. Um. That's it. <laughs> it's always it. <laughs> yeah, that is it. Now, we have not done this in a minute. It's been a minute. <laughs> it's been a minute. <laughs> <laughs> we should have done this, like, a long, long, longer time ago, but, uh, yeah. Well, like, even, like, the ones that we've done together, I feel like the last one we did together was, like, a few years ago. Yeah. Because... You've been doing KLG um, with other people, but for us to be doing this, I, yeah. It's, it's been a while. We, we haven't, yeah, I think uh, after we did a few shows, I did a whole bunch of solo shows because, you know, I was doing the after school specials on the ride home yeah. and all that kind of stuff. And then uh, those were entertaining. Yeah. <laughs> and then well, Alex, our good friend, Alex1188. Oh yes. Yes. Oh my god. He he I was miss joining. Him. He was joining us and it was me and him and his good friend Rob. So Rob, Rob. Would, Yeah, so Rob was in there. He was he was busting out all the metal jams. <laughs> it was mm-hmm. driving Alex crazy. <laughs> yeah. Because no, Alex is Alex that. is more for like, you know, synth type music and electro <laughs> and Rob was just torturing him with all now play this one cloudy girl play this one cloudy girl and there were all these crazy metal very cool progressive songs of progressive metal or whatever and I love that stuff it's really cool I, I mean I'm, I'm a fan I know it's driving Alex crazy though poor Alex <laughs> <laughs> poor Alex we miss yeah. you Alex we need to bring Alex back on the show yes I mean like, I remember that episode with him and, well, at least one of them with him and Rob. That was like, that was like a good two years ago. Yeah, that was. Listening to that. Yeah. Man, it time flies. And the, you know that those shows were going full deep into the night. Like, we would start them around 10 o'clock because I remember I wasn't doing them because I was watching Hannibal at that time. So I would see Hannibal, and when Hannibal was over, I'd jump on the computer, and then we'd, we'd do our little shows. But uh, we wouldn't end them until way, way in the wee hours of the morning. Like, it might have been, like, a whole, until, like, one in the morning or two in the morning in some cases. Like, it didn't, it, we were drunk. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, it's kind of like, well, I mean, 
well, I'm not drunk anymore. You're not drunk. It's it's kind of like what's going on now. Well, that's where every that's the time. That's the prime time where everyone's drinking. That's the way. That's what's going on, man. People want to hear this shit. Well, we'll entertain you. <laughs> <laughs> If we can, I don't know. It's been it's been a while, so. <laughs> Here we go. Now tell All me, right. tell me, tell me. Where did you just go? Not even six days ago. You need to oh tell me. Oh my god, has it been six days? I don't know I how long. Remember. I lost count. Tell me. <laughs> well, uh, I recently was at Magfest, which is a big video game convention uh, here on the East Coast. Yeah. And it's a uh, it's a big party, like. I mean, I've done a lot of different conventions before, um, like Anime Central and like chi- like Chicago area. Yeah. But this one's pretty. Pr- this is pretty decent. I heard the turnout was at least like twenty thousand oh, people. Wow. Yeah, like I just re- I see pictures from like the DJ rave and stuff, and it's just packed. But yeah, it's Magfest. It's crazy, but <laughs> uh, man, okay, well. This year, I kind of went low key. I didn't, I didn't do anything like performing wise. I just kind of want to enjoy it, the con because, like, when you're like a musician and you're like, you know, playing the cons, it's you know great and all, but sometimes it's a little bit stressful. Get making sure like you're, you got all your gear together. You're not having any like technical difficulties. Yeah, of any sort. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but. Yeah, I just figured this year I'd just go and get to see everything that I don't normally get to see. I mean, which wasn't which wasn't too much more than what I normally go and do because you, if you've been to like a panel of any sort, like once you've seen, like once you've attended five of them, you've kind of been to them all. Like they're just big discussions and based off of whatever topic. Right. I didn't really get to go to any of those, but it's all good. See, but is it is it different every year that you go? Have you noticed that it's different? Has it been getting bigger? Has it been getting crazier? Um, yes, it's been getting bigger. Uh, I know that this year it was like overwhelmingly bigger. Um, I mean, I stayed at the hotel itself, like the the Gaylord. It's held at the Gaylord Convention Center, something like that, and. Um, yeah, I was, which is normally where I stay, but, like, for some reason this year, it was harder getting out of the room. The elevators are always horrible. Like, right. I remember setting off the weight limit a couple times because we just <laughs> packed like, 20 people into those elevators. <laughs> oh, my gosh. But, you know, it, it's always a good time. I I recommend anybody who likes video gaming in general to go at least once because, they have like a huge arcade downstairs. It's all free. Oh, for real? So yeah, like you don't you got you don't have to pay quarters or anything. Like <laughs> they bring like all the cabinets from Japan. Oh, sweet. So you'll see like DDR and the Taiko drum game. All the old G- school. Oh yeah. Well, they have like weird, like newer things. Like I remember seeing like just a huge row of just rhythm based games and I did not and I'm like king of rhythm based games but there's a few of these I did not like even hear of yeah um but then they also have like old school cabinets so there was a time where I got done playing DDR and I played um oh gosh what's it called it's the it's an older game and it's like you're like mowing the lawn <laughs> or whatever like oh come on it's like it's kind of like dig dug you know like oh okay okay yeah yeah it's kind of like dig dug but you're like mowing and like you gotta like have the apples fall on the little guys that are chasing after you oh god i'll I'll remember i'll remember it but they got like galaga (laughs) and like miss pac-man oh the greats yeah they got like i don't know like all the racing games so like the I don't know, like Need for Speed and Mario Kart, whatever. And then they also have, like, console games. So you can just sit down at, like, one of the many consoles that they have downstairs and just play whatever games on the TV, so... That's cool. Yeah, they have, like, a lot of, like, Smash Brothers and... So it's... I mean, it's all video game stuff, but it's also 
you got live music going on too. Oh yeah. And like, the chip scene is really growing, right? Since since it started. Yes. Like I was surprised even last year, um when I heard that like Shirobon was playing, like just bringing over artists from like other countries, like that's pretty big because you know, for anyone that's in the chiptune scene, you know that you don't get paid really well to go and do stuff like this. Yeah. So <laughs> to have like in order to like bring someone over, you know, in order to play something like that, it's gotta cost a pretty penny. <laughs> yeah. So, especially the travel, the expenses, all that mm -hmm. kind of stuff. Yeah, and even like this year they had uh C Trix who's uh from Australia and then um Mono Deer is from Germany. Like they they're bringing people all over the place. Oh wow! So, yeah, Did and then it's you know not even just the chip tune. They have like their little like nerdcore scene, <laughs> and then they got um like all the metal video game metal based bands. So you have like I went and seen Bit Brigade. Bit Brigade. Bit Brigade. For the first time. Yes. Bit Brigade. <laughs> 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 Which I've never, I've heard of them, but I never, like, seen them before. I didn't know what they were about. And um, one of the guys I roomed with, uh, Jason, he was like, oh, you should go with me and go see them. I'm like, okay. <laughs> like, I didn't know what I was doing. But they, like, legit will play. They have a guy on the NES system, and he's speed running the games, but they're playing the music in the background. So, oh. like, the first game that they played was Castlevania. Yeah. So they got like the Castlevania theme playing on like these like metal, heavy metal riffs. And then they like time it all up to like where if they, if he dies or if he goes into a boss battle, they change up the music accordingly. And they did that for like three different games. Oh, wow. Yeah. It was like Castlevania, Batman, uh, DuckTales, it's it's intense it's it was a lot of fun like i didn't really expect anything like that and i've been this is like my third year at magfest <laughs> <laughs> see but this was the first time you really got to like just chill the entire yeah, time uh, you didn't have that pressure of having to play yeah it was it was it was an experience and i'm glad that i kind of went the way i did and not stress myself out with playing or anything like i i don't regret it at all it was it was definitely a lot more fun yeah. a lot more enjoyable uh and then there's so much stuff to buy i will okay <laughs> we brought a couple hundred dollars and it was gone like they have like the dealer's room and they have like people bringing in like consoles and like games from japan they even have like anime figurines and oh wow uh, uh my girlfriend bought pokemon cards <laughs> <laughs> um i i spent most of my money on just like all like musician stuff so yeah i yeah i just bought a bunch of chiptune cds because i never get to do that i don't even i don't really own chiptune cds <laughs> so well, it, that was nice to support you know and and that's that's fucking cool what oh yeah. i remember last year was it last year that you went out there you were live streaming yeah oh yeah that is right we were live streaming in the um <laughs> in the arcade yeah oh my god it was intense like but like if you only see the video, you can see with, like, how packed it gets down there. And the arcade does not have closing hours. It is 24-7. Oh, so yeah? So if you are, like, partied out, you sobered up by, like, 4.30 in the morning and you still feel awake, you can go to the arcade room and just chill there until everyone wakes up at 9 o'clock. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Okay. It's definitely fun. Let me see here. It's been a while since I've done this, and I'm getting a little message that says time is almost up. So <laughs> I don't know if that means it's over or we have to restart a new one. But Oh, is it, is it going to do that thing? It's going to do that thing, and Spreaker, I haven't even used it in forever, so this is new to me. Because I swear to you, we used to do, like, 
hours and hours of a show. Well, maybe not hours. Yeah, maybe we- freezing. <laughs> and the lines for everything and anything food-wise in the area are incredibly long. Like, Chipotle actually ran out of tortillas. <laughs> what? So everyone was getting stuff in bowls, which was fine. <laughs> um, we always uh, order in from this place called Danny's, which sells subs and Chinese food. Yeah. Oh, so good. <laughs> No, nothing like some General Sows and some Lo Mein and Mayfoon, and then to have it like the next day. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. It's beautiful. So you you totally recommend going out there, huh? Oh yeah, yeah. One day, one day, maybe I can get you to come out there. Me? Yeah, you can you can room with the cool kids, which are us. Oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> uh, but you know, it, it was good. I didn't really see too much like chip tune stuff. They had like the chip tune rave, and then they had like a DJ battle. Um, I was there for the DJ battle, but not for the whole night because that goes on to like three in the morning. Um, which I wanted to make sure I could sleep okay and get up in the morning so to ha- experience wait, so everything. They had a battle then. They had battles? Yes. How did they do them? How did they do it? Well, the DJ battle was more of like the DJs would just kind of take turns getting up there. Um, Or they would like kind of switch off like mid-song. It was kind of cool. Um, The chiptune one wasn't really like a battle as much as it was just a bunch of musicians just playing like a normal show. Yeah. Um, But that one I wasn't there for. Oh, so you didn't, you didn't get to see, like, if it was something they did with uh, going back and forth or if they just played yeah, one no. track I, uh, and then another. I watched the, uh, what was it, the, the live stream. They had a clip stream going on. Oh, yeah. And I was just partying in the room, and then I was watching the clip stream, <laughs> not being surrounded by massive amounts of people. So you were there, but you were there in spirit. Yes. I was watching from the computer. <laughs> In your safe space. <laughs> <laughs> yes, where I can enjoy, you know, a beer or five and, you know, not have to deal with the elevators, so. <laughs> Are they really that crowded? That would freak me out. I don't know if I'm good with yeah with crowds. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Like, well, and then some of them... It's not, like, uncommon for them to break down during the con, either. Oh, so. I, I don't know about that. Did it happen? <laughs> were, you, were you in there when that happened? Did you experience that? Oh, no. Thank God. <laughs> no. I wouldn't freak out, but it's just kind of like, uh, you know, you don't want to be, like, in a freaking elevator with, like, 15 other people it's the it's, but it's like more like the unknown like you don't know how long you're gonna be in there and you don't know how long it's gonna <laughs> take before the doors will open again it's like it would freak a person out uh-huh and then the <laughs> elevators are like glass so you can see into like the main atrium oh wow <laughs> yeah oh uh, good time nothing I, nothing naughty going on no. Everybody behaves yeah. pretty well. Uh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> well, not that I really know of. I I mean, I know that one of the nights we all got pretty drunk and we were just laughing about just random stuff. And, I mean, nothing crazy naughty, but I'm sure there's many naughty people there. <laughs> <laughs> but nobody nobody gets like in trouble with the with the police or anything like that. They they oh, haven't no. had like a fight or something crazy go down. No. Everybody's pretty yeah. calm for the most part, right? Yeah, I mean, if you think about it, it's like a convention for the most socially awkward people in the <laughs> world. So no, nothing really crazy happens. And, you know, like, well, I I jokingly say that, but it's, like, so true. But, like, everyone is super friendly. Because you're you're talking to, like, your nerd brethren. 
Uh, but yeah, MacFest was a blast. That's cool. I don't, I haven't gone out there, and I've been aware of of uh, probably since 2010 that it's been. When, when did it start? Oh gosh, I don't know. It, it's been a while because it used to be. I believe they said that they used to have MagFest in Richmond, Virginia, like when it first started. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then they moved it out to Maryland, which I almost think they're going to, like within the next couple of years, they're going to move it again because it's getting to be too big for that little area. Yeah. So, which that'll be kind of better, but we'll see what happens in the future. And what yeah. else, what else have you been doing? What have you been up to music wise, <laughs> music wise? <laughs> <laughs> um, not a whole lot. I mean, I have... I've been working on stuff. Um, I recently did a collab uh, with another musician, um, but I don't know if that's something I am allowed to say out loud yet because it's on a comp album or whatever, Um, which I do know that it's being released next Friday. Oh. So it's, I... Me and another musician did a song together, and it's for, like, a Nintendo Core compilation album. Oh, sweet. So, yeah, so that'll be out hopefully by next Friday, because I just talked to him today about it. Um, But other than that, everything's been pretty low-key. Been messing around with stuff, LSDJ, and then messing around with stuff on the DS, and, um, yeah. And tell me about your violin. I, my what? Your violin. My violin. Oh, <laughs> I love it. And I, I, uh, I got, I got myself an electric violin. Um, they're actually not that expensive. You can get them really cheap on Amazon, and it doesn't sound that bad. But I am hopingly trying to do something to where I can like fuse it all together I've been it's kind of hard because you really have to like transcribe everything and like I usually play by ear anyways but like I won't be able if I'm improv <laughs> at home I'm not gonna be able to remember notes if I go anywhere else <laughs> <laughs> but no that's you know just been messing around with the violin a little bit with tracks that I have already completed and tracks that I have not released yet. So I'm hoping I can get something out by, I don't know. I know that um, I want to have something out by at least uh, late springtime, but not for sure yet. Nothing's like set in stone. So. Well, that's cool. And, it, and think of it this way though, if you do end up doing it like jamming out in essence then when you play live you would always be a new fresh jam you wouldn't have to remember what you did before just always make up new shit and that's what i that's what i do with the chaos later when i play that i i never practice that i can't duplicate what i do if i turn it off everything is gone so it doesn't save anything i have the old school chaos later so you hear it while it's being played, while I'm making it at that spot, and that's it. And then it's gone forever. Oh. Uh, yeah. So I can only record it, but I can't ever duplicate it again unless uh, unless it's been recorded and then played back. You know, like on an MP3 or something. Mm-hmm. That sounds so nice. Like, I, I really hope I can, like, do something similar like that. It opens just... up your creativity big time because you're always doing something different. Yeah. I I want to, like, in the near future, I don't know when, but do a stream myself where uh, I'm messing around just to kind of, kind of like a intro LSDJ to help people out a little bit, because I've been thinking about doing stuff like that, but also doing more live work with LSTJ and the violin, but I have to get over playing in front of people. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm working on that. I've been playing in front of my girlfriend and I'm getting better at it. <laughs> and now I'm inviting friends over and they're listening to me play. So it, it's a work in progress. You're playing but... for the dogs. 
Yes, I play for the dogs. I play for the cats. <laughs> My best audience. <laughs> <laughs> How adorable. Did I tell you I used to have a cat way back in the day? And she liked it when I would sing. And back back in the day, I'm talking like when I was doing my acoustic stuff and playing guitar and singing my own songs and writing music back then in the very early, like 2003 or before that time. She would jump on me every time I'd sing. She had this, 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 she freaked out because she didn't know what I was doing. She knew the voice was coming out of me, but she didn't know that side of me. So I would be singing and then she'd just jump on top of me and just oh. like look at me really close. How you do that, human? <laughs> <laughs> like she wanted to steal my breath away. You know how they say that little myth about the cats that do that to the little girls and little boys? Oh my god, she, no. She honestly would do that. She'd jump up on my chest if I was laying down and singing. She'd come from whatever <laughs> room she was at. She'd just come charging, jump up on top of the bed, get on top of my chest, and then just like try to steal my breath. <laughs> Ursula cat. It was crazy. It was crazy. She was, uh, she was pretty crazy, man. Cammy. Her name was Cammy. Cammy. Rest in peace, Cammy. You took my breath uh, away. You took my... Oh. 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 Oh, it got shady. Oh, Ta-da. there's another one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Oh. oh, God, shady. All day today, we've been trying to, like, remember all the slang from, like, the last, like, well, like, 10 years. <laughs> it's, it's, it hasn't really been that hard to do. Like, I'm amazed that I've remembered uh, quite a lot of them, and that's because they're not even from my time. It's just stuff <laughs> I had to accustom myself to because of all the, what was going on all over the place. Like, that's all I saw on Facebook. That's what the way people are writing things down. Mm-hmm. You know, oh, trill. That's so trill. Trill. <laughs> <laughs> I'm weak. I'm weak. I'm, I'm weak. I'm done. <laughs> uh, see, I'm I'm still the weird one that says radical and cool beans. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> that was my time. That was my. Time. <laughs> now those I know, but there's like a whole bunch of them right now that I still don't know what they are. Like, I know I hear fam all the time. Bam. I guess that means oh like God. guys, right? Like you guys, but you say fam. Yeah. So like I've heard my people, my peeps. My peeps. I remember my peeps, <laughs> and then it's lit. It's so lit right now. Uh, everything's <laughs> lit right now. Or I'm so faded. Remember that one? Faded. Oh my God. Yeah. Like there was like crunk and faded. Crunk. And, oh my. Yeah, we're gonna get crunk. Oh my God. I wish. <laughs> <laughs> now you acting a damn fool. <laughs> you act like a damn fool. Oh my gosh. It's been good. We might have to go into part three. Are we? Is I've, it already? I, I've been watching this. You're watching I don't, it? Yeah. Because I think mine's been like lively uh, going into like what minute we're on because i'm on the page i got 13 minutes on here so it hasn't given oh, me the, god. the warning oh yet. god we're wasting time oh it gives you yeah you're right it does give you a warning why am i paranoid about this well thing? you know what uh i didn't want to say it because you were deep into the story but we missed like some of the beginning of this uh part and i got it right when you're talking about uh eating food at that one place was oh it, god what was it called chipotle chipotle i got i got it from there because i had to delete some other episodes to make room it told me i reached my limit so here what? i was in a fury just deleting stuff that i knew that i already have backed up somewhere else <laughs> okay so the tiny oh, itty bitty beginning of that is you won't hear it so that's okay. that's why we were still okay now i got the warning <laughs> okay. there we go <laughs> So now we'll end this right and we'll be back and we're probably going to play some music, some Sounds good. some favorites and some, some of our own stuff. So yeah. All right, cool. It's going to be like that. It's going to be lit. <laughs> it's going to be lit, fam. 
<laughs> hey, we are live with KLG Crazy Awesome Radio and we are going to play some tracks real quick. What do you got for us, Panda? Um be playing three tracks. Uh these are all musicians that were at Magfest, so I felt it was appropriate. <laughs> yeah. So uh, first off we're gonna start with one of my personal favorites. Uh it's from uh Musician titled My Parents' Favorite Music. Up was an intermission of break. I was too caught up with the thought of never living down my head's mistake. I was always telling myself, heaven or hell, let's rock for the break to follow through. They beat me to the draw if I was gonna get past level two. So I watched other go right by me, and I said, why me? Bellow dramatic cliche, stuck on a weak plate. Instead of lack of progress, to stop the process. Everybody needs just one of these to look for. Uh, uh, come on. Take a break, create a safe. What you do from here is okay. Dot, infinite time with no regrets. Take a break, enter your name. Make it stupid and play the game. Don't care, don't think, don't fear, just get reset. There's another ride up the line of the end. The end of the end of the line with the heart for being sick. God, hope, help, we'll stay with me. Well, so is life. We'll stay with me. Well, so is life. We'll stay with me. Well, so is life. We'll stay with me. We'll say la vie, we'll say la vie, we'll say la vie. Got 99 problems, all the nations ran out of leashes, don't have the patience, left my keys and I got locked out, so I built another house. I don't even use words like this, or do I believe in the word fact? The road less traveled became the highway, but highway is ripping them back in half. So try out life in 3D, turn off the TV. Richter scale, then etch a sketch, turn and start fresh. Live like nobody's watching, be your own rock queen. is going to be Dogs by Mono Deer. Thank <laughs> you. 
God, I love that song. No, no. I don't know if we can handle it another time. <laughs> now, I recently just discovered like this this album. This is one of the albums that I bought when I was at Magfest. That it's was freaking really good. Amazing. Yeah, all all the music that I'm playing, uh, these are albums that I purchased. So, yeah, my parents' favorite music. Oh, so watching her live is just intense. Oh, all that hip hop, but uh we're uh, <laughs> the freaking I'm sorry that dog <laughs> song I like blast that shit like in my car when I'm rolling into work <laughs> the bass in that song is intense oh, oh my gosh but uh <laughs> I'm gonna end it with um uh, a uh, this musician uh this is actually a female chip tea musician uh called Corset Lore and this was one of my favorite tracks from the album that I got. So here we go. All right. <laughs>
<laughs> I I gotta ask her because like the reason why I like that song so much is there's like so much going on that you can like if you've ever worked with LSDJ you can definitely tell that there's a lot of like different um, patterns like I almost want to ask her like because it sounds like she's doing a lot of stuff like very very live and altering like like transitioning almost because you can transition on the program Oh yeah. So like up, go up a couple steps or something. Like, I, gosh, it's like a cool thing. And yeah, a sucky thing about LSDJ is you like I know personally that I spend time like dissecting songs. Yeah. Like I'm like, oh, how do they do that? What channel is that in? Like that's what I'm constantly thinking about. I'm like, is this one LSDJ or is this two? <laughs> <laughs> like the limitations are almost crazy because like there will be musicians like. I believe that this is one LSDJ, but it sounds like there's two going on because of everything that's happening in one of the channels. Yeah. I don't know. It, it's, it's all little sound DJ talk. <laughs> Normally when I talk to people about it, they're like, what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to have to ask her. Cause are, are you going to do, cool. are you going to do another tutorial? Oh God. I, I don't know. I guess I could. It, it's it's so hard doing the tutorials because, like, I don't know exactly what people are looking for, but it's easier, like, if I can, like, talk to the person, like, one-on-one. -on -one. Oh. Like, I almost want to, like, start doing streams where um, I'm working along with somebody, but I have to figure out, like, how to get that to work. Because it'd be really cool if we can, like, back-to-back -back where I can be, like... Okay, this is what you're doing. Yeah, like, that's the that's the only real way to learn. Like, there should be like a little like chiptune class or something. Where <laughs> it's a Game Boy, and they all have the program in there, and then you have the teacher that's like, hold select and to the left. <laughs> Game Boy class. A Game Boy class. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. <laughs> Okay. Okay, okay, we're live, we're live. This All is, right. this is, okay, we're live. KLG, Crazy Awesome Radio, with Cloudy Girl, Panda Star. What are we going to do? We're, we're going to do a song together. Yeah. We're, we're going to do a mix. <laughs> it's going to be, <laughs> gonna it's gonna be a live mix. Yes. So we're playing live together at the same tempo. Yeah, you're on a we're game. Gonna, we're gonna do it. You're on a Game Boy. I'm on a Nintendo DS. Yep. We're not so even on the DJ versus Korg DS10. Korg DS10. Ten. Okay. <laughs> 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 I know there's a few of them out there. I don't know which one you. <laughs> so we're gonna try that, and the rules are. What are the, the rules? Ru <laughs> the, we have no rules. <laughs> <laughs> The rules are, uh, well, we have them set on the same tempo, and I guess uh, one person is going to go first, and then the other person can go, like, either, like, add on or go, like, after them. Is that okay. how we decided this? Yeah. And then we are just going to... We're just, just going to go jam. With, yeah, we're just going to go with the flow of things. It might, it might sound good. It might not, but we're having fun, so whatever. <laughs> we're gonna do it. <laughs> I, I don't. Uh, are we? Are we gonna rock paper scissors for who goes first? Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Well, they can't hear, or <laughs> well, they can hear. They cannot see. <laughs> Okay, but ready? We, we won't lie here. We're, okay, how are we going to do this? One, two, three, go. Okay, one, two, three, go, and then rock, papers. <laughs> we fail at this. Okay, are we going to go rock, paper, scissors, shoot? Yeah, do it. Okay, okay. <laughs> rock. So do it fast. Do it okay, fast. Okay. okay, okay. Rock, paper, paper scissors, scissors, shoot. shoot. Okay, scissors, rock. You win. Oh fuck. Okay, you, so you you go. <laughs> you start. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh... Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> what? <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> Let me just say, this is the, like, I challenge anybody and everybody to try a jam through the internet <laughs> with whatever uh, horrible service provider that you have, <laughs> as well as the other party member, and try to make something happen out of it. <laughs> I I did not hear, like, anything on your side. All I hear is click. click. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, at least the clicks are on beat. So I hope it sounds good on that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god oh my that god. was fun that's what a drunken fest friday should be <laughs> right oh yes what would you call oh that god. what would you call that noise live live chippy noise yeah we're just gonna because it's call a clash it of cheese. styles i'm i'm a different style <laughs> than you <laughs> we're, we're, it's gonna I think this is a cheese, this is a cheese. I, I really liked how you put cheese in there <laughs> it's a cheese sandwich it's it's cheese and crackers <laughs> it's cheesy chips cheesy, cheesy chi there you go cheesy chips <laughs> and crackers <laughs> and cray cray crackers and cray cray crackers <laughs> oh my gosh oh my face Oh, that was fun. That was. I can't wait to hear it back. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Now, that could uh, either be the most embarrassing thing we've ever done <laughs> 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 or the most awesome thing we ever discovered. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I don't even care if it's like somewhat embarrassing. It was fun. <laughs> Like the internet got to hear it for whatever it was worth. <laughs> the, That's you never not know easy when this do. is ever going to happen again. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> if only we had the video working. That was so oh. weird. That was so crazy if you would have yes. seen that. <laughs> you were oh. all intent on just looking down. I... You never hardly ever looked up at me. I felt all alone. I I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I'm not really good at making eye contact in these situations. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't know I was sad and lonely. <laughs> no, I didn't mean to leave you. I was like so hard trying to concentrate and then I felt like I, I would hate to see what the video of my face looked like because I'm sure I made all sorts of weird faces. There's a point <laughs> I got my mouth is really dry. I've been talking too much. But there's a point where my lip was like stuck on my teeth. <laughs> and now I'm not even focusing on the music. I'm like, my teeth. That was so fun. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'll have to work better on my eye contact. <laughs> You know what though? That was so much fun. Other people no, should was. other people should do this. They really should. Yes. This is so crazy. It's very hard to do. It is. Because <laughs> literally like that's all I heard on my end was clicking. And I think it was because I had like the sound feeding into like the computer. I don't know if like because when I stop is when or no no, it's not when I stop. When I play something that's a little bit quieter, yeah, I can hear your stuff kind of coming out again. And I'm like, Oh, okay. So it is going along with it and I was just making I was just trying to make sure like everything was going because there are points where I'm like, Oh my god, what am I doing? I know that if okay, if we're gonna do this another time I'm going to make something up or like maybe we can try to make something up live, like just brand new. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That way I have, like, well, I know personally I have more control over my channels. <laughs> <laughs> I had no control. But that's what makes it so much fun. <laughs> the lack of control. Because you have to admit, a lot of people that play this kind of music are very, very particular with how their music sounds and they mm -hmm. you know they would never just do that why would oh, they oh no <laughs> i i feel it i feel i feel the stress 
I was like, oh, but no, it was, that was so much fun. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Where'd you go? <laughs> I mean, you didn't have to leave me. I'm so sorry I left you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm definitely, I want to make up, or at least have a few nice things kind of pre-made. Well, yeah, then, we could do that and too. And then have a little bit more, like things I can more so like transpose and it can, it can have its own way. Well, we something. weren't, we weren't being serious. We were kidding around. Oh yeah. No, <laughs> Everyone, this is a joke. <laughs> or just a big, big joke. Cheese and crackers. <laughs> yeah, we were, just, we were just jamming. We were just making up shit. That was oh. already there, but making up when it played and when it didn't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we could definitely do that again. That's fun. Or, like, we should, like, do, oh, you know what we could do? Now, now we're brainstorming. This now is, we're brainstorming. The, rem the remainder is going to be brainstorming. Yeah. Uh, we should, like, put, like, a bunch of our songs, like, the names of, like, our certain tracks and oh, we'll the pick ones that one we're out using? each. Yeah, yeah. We'll pick one out each, and then that's going to be the one that we fuck with, and we play it together like that. Okay. Like, it'll just be, like, a, a baby. <laughs> Ma m mashed potato. I don't know. <laughs> I, got, I got nothing. <laughs> yeah, we need to do that again, but plan it a little bit better. But it would be, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sure we won't have as many technical difficulties. Now but that we, we kind of know. Now that we know, see, because now next time we're really going to be good. <laughs> <laughs> We've done this once before. Yes, yes. <laughs> we, we've gone through the trial and error <laughs> for goodly for badly it happened <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh so uh, i don't know with that we need to go i need to go <laughs> yes i know i need to go too i have to oh i should probably sleep soon <laughs> <laughs> oh hype. This, i'm hyped this was fun this got me all excited Yes, uh, we're gonna have to do it again. We'll we'll have to be better about scheduling it. And we can get so other that people way. to join us if they want. Yes, to. let's get Alec, Alec, Alex to join us. That'd be great. <laughs> that would uh, be cool. Okay. Well, successful. A yeah. successful drunken fest. <laughs> it happened. Until until it happens again or it doesn't. Who knows? Oh, it'll happen again. We'll, we'll make it happen. <laughs>